is just like in any business is indicated, uh, uh, morale is always uh, can be an issue and, and it's of utmost importance. Um, yes, we provided pay increases while other school districts couldn't. Uh, we had a healthy fund balance and, 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 and we did what we could. We, we provide uh, we provide uh, recognition to to the teachers uh, on a, on a monthly basis. Um, yes, there are mandates that come down from the state that we can't control. They are frustrated. We understand that. So we need to, as a board and as administration, and we'll continue to do this, is put the pressure on the administration to to be to be a, a, a more approaching individual and, and that's a goal that we have always uh, talked about and we will ensure that this will continue to happen is to be very supportive uh, because the teacher morale uh, there is some low morale but there's also some good there's some good things that are going on and we want to strive to do the best we can all right thank you also a candidate in district two charles lock please mm -hmm. i guess first of all need to find out down and when we find out that problem then we address why the morale is down and any job that we do it's a passion it has nothing to do about the pay or anything we do it because we love to do the job so once we find out that morale is down then we find out why what do we have to change to get the people with morale back up make sure that they're happy they have the right tools they have the right equipment we just need to get to keep the morale that needs to come up they let us know what's going on because the teachers they have a passion they they do it because they want to do it not because it's a job so that's how we need to do we need to find out why the morale is down and make the adjustment and let them go forward All right, thank you.